Hey, did you see Sunny and Courtney outside? Yeah, can, can I just get some coffee? Is everything okay? How's your arm? I started bleeding again last night. It made me think about when you were shot. And I realized how easily you could have died. I nearly killed because of me twice. Can't happen again. Isn't it a little late for this? I mean, Jason, everybody already knows that we had this friendship. I mean, the people who kidnapped me knew we were close. That's why they took I'm, I'm me. I'm not why gonna be the reason that it happens to you again. So your solution is to act like we don't even know each other? Well, what's so good about knowing me? Well, how long do I have to answer that? I've tried to tell you what you mean to me, but for some reason... I don't want to hurt you. And I am, and it keeps happening, so the best thing... is just to let it go. What, no tip? It's on the table. Well, I had something else in mind. What? Take me for a ride on your bike. Just the two of us. We'll streak past the city line. We'll, we'll take the cliff road. What do you think? Elizabeth, it's getting more dangerous. So you should probably forget about that ride. Wrong answer. I could cover your shift if you want to take off with Jason. Oh, thanks, Betty. Apparently he's not interested. Well, he seemed pretty interested to me. So Jason just has a lot of stuff going on because of the work he does for Sunny. I'd rather not know. Yeah, well, that's how Jason wants me to feel about it. You know, he's trying to push me away from him until everything's been resolved. Well, that sounds reasonable. Oh, God, I hate that word. Sorry. No, 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 it's, it's, it's not you. It's just, I hate when things get decided for me. You know, like, maybe I don't want to be nice or patient or cooperative, reasonable. <laughs> yeah, I hear that. Jason just makes me feel like it's okay to be me. And I can be totally honest or mouth off and complain or be happy and it feels great. What's so wrong with that? Nothing. Hello. Jason Morgan. Yeah, who's this? Best point. One hour. Be there. Hey, 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 hey. Tell him no lackeys. I meet with him only. You understand? What is this? An unconventional date. Who called me on the phone? Um, Gavin, the, the, um, the bus boy. I, You've been I, shot, kidnapped, you almost died. You think this is a game? I know exactly okay, what good. this then is. Okay, good. stay away from me. I will. In public. No. Nowhere. I told you we cannot do this. Okay, just listen to me for a minute, okay? There's nothing to discuss, Elizabeth. I get that it's dangerous, Jason. I, I completely get that. But I figured we can see each other in private. Okay, listen, I, I admit that the call from Gavin was pretty lengthy. I am not taking any more chances with your life. What could possibly happen out here? Nobody followed me. We're alone. Can't we just enjoy it? No. Where are you going? Please don't. <sighs> don't follow me. You're only gonna get lost. Jason, you were such a liar. 
I have never lied to you. You're not running away to protect me. You're doing it to protect yourself. You are not safe with me. Everything's a risk. You care about someone, they care back. Make you believe you have a chance. And then all of a sudden they turn around and they do this 180. Close off, show interest in somebody else. Make you think that the two of you had wasn't important. When it was. That's what I did to you, Jason. And I'm sorry. I don't... I just want you out of this. That's it. Don't you get it yet? It's not okay for you to just drop out of my life. I would miss you too much. The way you just let me be whoever I want to be. The way you listen to me. The way you care. Like no one ever has before.